After signing for Manchester United, the club he loves, he's gone on to join Real Madrid, the Spanish giants, just like his father did when he was playing for United. First press conference for Ancelotti, the press asking him how he actually got about this transfer. I really think I can do it. I held on to my promise that I'm gonna bring back Ronaldo and I actually did so hope that he brings us the Champions League very soon so first game of the season it is against Atletico Bilbao can Ronaldo and Real Madrid get three points in the very first game here's Bellingham oh he's through and a goal for Real Madrid and assist for Cristiano Ronaldo Jr Bellingham off to a flyer and in the Champions League, Napoli, Braga and Union Berlin from Germany are in our group. And 19 games into the season, we are six ahead of Barcelona and the toughest team we have to play in La Liga and made it to the Supercoppa against Atletico Madrid in two-legged tie and beaten by, actually drew to United at Old Trafford, but beaten at home at Bernabeu out of the Champions League and look at that with only seven games remaining we're six behind Barcelona now and we have to win at Santiago Bernabeu to get three points and close the gap here's Rafinha goes where's the defense no and Rafinha scores for Barcelona an early goal in the fourth minute for the Brazilian and Barcelona lead early here's Ronaldo Jr on the ball goes past the defense oh he's having one of the worst games today i've seen barcelona held on to win and look at that season we lost the title by 11 points but beat barcelona in the super cup of final 2 nil. what a win and also beat las palmas 1 nil in the final so that's true trophies for ronaldo but United went on to win the Champions League season number six. First game of the season is against Almeria. We have to get the season off to a flyer and get three points. Is Ronaldo Jr. Oh, he's made the run and he's going to score. Yes, he beats the goalkeeper oh, into the roof of the net. And that's the first goal. I'm best player in the team. I need to follow my dad's footsteps and stay calm. The Champions League is coming soon. And look at that, 16 games into the season, guys. We are three ahead of Barcelona. We are not going to lose ground. And Ronaldo is currently leading the race for the Golden Boot. And Villarreal is the team we have to play today at Bernabeu. One of the worst performances I've seen for my team so far. Parejo! Oh, into the far corner. And uh, Courtois beaten on the hour mark. Villarreal have taken the lead. Oh, the game's going to go bad to worse for Real Madrid. A penalty given by Nacho. And this could be it. Chance for Moreno. And Car Courtois saves. We beaten by Real Atletico Madrid in the Super Coma out in the semis. Beaten, beaten United 4-0, a replay of the last season, last 16 draw. We beat Sevilla 6-2 on aggregate. And now in this league, eight games remaining, head-to-head, -head, same points against Barcelona. And playing Barcelona in the Champions League semi-final. And for now, we are going to Bernabeu against Barcelona, a team we have to beat to win the title and he's neck to neck at the moment is Ronaldo is he gonna pass he does own goal no he didn't make the pass but it is an own goal Real Madrid take the lead is Ronaldo again he's looking for the pass no he's gonna shoot into the far corner just taken beaten this guy is going to be a superstar in the future but beaten by Barcelona in the Champions League semi-final. That is a bad result. But there we go, guys. Last game of the season. A point would be enough against Real Betis. And the title would be ours. Come on, boys. Here's Ronaldo. He's going to score. Yes, he is going to score in the last day of the season. Uh, we just have to get a point today. But here's Betty. Oh, Carvalho! Oh, is there a twist in the tail in this title race? Seven minutes to defend, guys. We just need a point. And into the last seconds of the game, and it's full time. Yes, 
We won the title. Beaten Barcelona by a single point. Who actually won their game at uh, Camp Nou. Celebrations all round, guys. Jumping around in circles. Great achievement from Cristiano Ronaldo and his team. And that's what he was here for. The La Liga. And Nacho is the captain. He's going to lift it. And that's the first major silverware of Ronaldo's Real Madrid career. I have seen uh, his team win two trophies last season. But Champions League and La League is what he's here for. And the Ballon d'Or. Is it? Rivaldo's showing. And Cristiano Ronaldo Jr. is the Ballon d'Or winner. Oh, what, what an achievement for this young Portuguese superstar. And season number seven, Cristiano Jr. is staying put in Real Madrid. He has some unfinished business. And it is the Champions League trophy. We are in quarterfinal against the German giants Bayern Munich. Here's uh, Rodrigo. Passes on to Vinny Jr. And that's an early goal for Real Madrid. We actually got two early goals in the first 40 minutes. Vinicius Jr. getting the brace. And into the second half, it was Cristiano Ronaldo's show. He got the third for Real Madrid. And that is a massive leap into the semi-final. Although there is a second leg to play. But Real Madrid are one step into the semis. Kinsley Coleman then went on to give a penalty. Which Ronaldo... Had to score and oh, he missed. Oh, German goalkeeper saved. And in the second leg, away to Bayern Munich. Can Bayern actually get a 3-0 victory over Real Madrid and make it to the Champions League semis? And guess what? In the last minute, Kinsley Coman made it 1-0. We lost the away game, but made it to the semi-final. It is Kinsley Coman who actually gave the penalty away. A bit of redemption then. In the semis, we went to Anfield against Liverpool. Mo Salah, he's got some revenge to do. So has Liverpool. So guys, I think Real Madrid can make it to the semis. Oh, what's they done? It's Gagpo. He's one and only the goalkeeper. He's going to score. And he does. Oh, poor defensive error. You can't do that in the Champions League semi-final. And only eight minutes on the clock. And here's a chance. Oh, Konate has been penalised. A chance for Real Madrid to get right back into the game. And Ronaldo into the top corner. Scoring at Anfield again. Oh, he loves scoring at Anfield. And he does it again here. And first 45 minutes are over at Anfield. One of the best displays from Real Madrid and Liverpool throughout the season. They have been providing some great moments. Here's a chance for Rodrigo. Into the last two minutes. Where's Van Dijk when you need him? Oh, what a say by Alisson. Robertson should clear. No, he doesn't. He loses out to Bellingham. Bellingham to Rodrigo. And Real Madrid have won it. Into the 109th, uh, actually 92nd minute of the game. Real Madrid have won it. They've won it in the clutches. Where is the keeper? Where is the defence? Poor goal school. Uh, poor school boy error that is from Real, uh, from Liverpool. Madrid went on to win 2-1 in away game. And surely they're not going to lose at home. They can't drop. Can't drop this semi-final and give it to Liverpool. And second leg would be hectic. Early start from Rodrigo. He's up to the races. Oh, what a save by Alisson. Pushing it out for a corner. Here's a chance for Rodrigo. And that should be it. Ronaldo Jr. scores. Surely Madrid are into the final now. And who they're playing into the final will be decided tomorrow. And it is PSG. And we are playing at Wembley Stadium. Ronaldo Jr. versus Mbappe. Two players who are going head to head for the first time. And both of their play both of their idol is the same man, Cristiano Ronaldo, the legend himself. And this is the final. They have to win. Here's Carvajal crosses in. Camavinga! 
Ah, where is the defense? Where's the marking? Oh, poor defending by PSG, the French giants. But Real Madrid have taken the lead. And this could be their 15th Champions League victory. Is Valverde, Cristiano Ronaldo Jr. And Donnarumma is beaten. 2-0, 40 minutes onto the clock. This is becoming a hum humiliation for PSG in the final. But here's Ronaldo. Oh, dinks it over. No great save. And Rodrigo pounces in the rebound. And that is 3-0 in the final. Absolutely shambles. Ronaldo. Oh, great save. Oh, what's he done? Marquinhos. Oh, Rafa Ronaldo is going to score. But Marquinhos puts it into his own net after Donnarumma save. And then Mbappe is through. What a save. Oh, he wallies it in. And he had the audacity to go and slide in front of the Real Madrid players. Final whistle's gone. 4-1 on the night. We are the champions. We won the uh, Champions League for Real Madrid. What a final that's been. And this is the trophy every single player wants to win in their career. And it is Carvajal to lift it. A trophy. Real Madrid has won it the most time. 15 it is now. Oh, and still counting. What celebrations. And guys, if you're liking the video so far, do subscribe to my channel. And by the way, there is rumours that Ronaldo could be joining Saudi and confirming the talks, uh, Ancelotti actually gone to Saudi. And guess what? Ronaldo has joined his father in Saudi Arabia. Ronaldo Jr. is taking number nine. Of course, he's not going to take number seven away from his dad. Or else he's going to slap him twice. First game, it is against Al-Hilal. Neymar is fit. And that's a big surprise. He's fit to play today, guys. Biggest game of the season. And it is the first game of the season. Would you believe it, guys? Ladies and gentlemen. And what a season this is going to be. Here's a chance for Milinkovic Savage. Mitrovic. Oh, he scores in the fourth minute. What's this here? Only four minutes on the clock. And Al Nasser are already a goal down. And not the best of performances. But it's Mane with the equaliser. And Al Nasser finally salvage a point. Oh, they've been poor throughout the first half, but now they've got it. Here's a chance for Mane. Oh, he's gone down too easily, too easily, but referee points to the spot. And who else to take it? Ronaldo took it. He scored, and that is 2-1. And nine games into the season, we're actually top of the table at the moment. And uh, this could be the final for the Asia Continental Cup. Two Saudi teams going head to head. And this time is Al Etihad against Al Nasser in the Asian Continental Final. And this is, by the way, the Asian Champions League, you can call it. Here's a chance for Ronaldo Jr. No, Cristiano Ronaldo. His father, the senior Ronaldo, scores. And he's just suing in front of the camera. And Al Nasser are a goal up. Here's Ronaldo Jr. Father like son. And it is 2-0 in the final for Al Nasser. Oh, this is unbelievable scenes. Father and son do a scoring and giving them the Asian Champions League. Ronaldo is the captain and vice captain is son. Both father and son lifting the biggest trophy in Asian football. And guys, final game of the season. Nothing but a win will give us the title. And it is against Al Ahly. We have to win. And Ronaldo. Oh, he scores. A brilliant goal outside the box. And that is 2-1 to Al Nasser. Here's Ronaldo. Dinks it over the goalkeeper. And that is 3-1 to Al Nasser. This kid is unbelievable. Sky's the limit at the moment. Here's a corner. A clearance. Oh, back to Ronaldo. He scored a hat-trick. Oh, he managed to squeeze it under the goalkeeper. In the 94th minute of the game, this Portuguese wonder kid, is he going to win the second Ballon d'Or? But what now is the league? The league goes to Al Nasser. They won it. They had to win the final game of the season. And they are the champions. Cristiano Ronaldo lifts it. 
and Junior actually got the hat trick on the final day of the season. So that's it for the video. But, oh, but uh, let me tell you, there is a Ballon d'Or ceremony that we are going to watch. So stay tuned and keep watching. And he manages to win his second Ballon d'Or. And that is two Ballon d'Or back to back. Just like his father in 2013 and 14 season. And guys, thanks for watching my video. That's it for Ronaldo Jr. career mode. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Do subscribe to my channel. And thanks for watching, guys.